Hello, this is Jeff from System Trader Success, and I want to show you an indicator that has been excellent at capturing the major market moves over the past 15 years or so. You want to get out before the financial crisis? There it is. You want to get back in in 2009? Well, this is telling you to do it. And of course, this is a free indicator, and it's available for download on the website. If you're viewing this video somewhere else other than System Trader Success, please go and check out SystemTraderSuccess.com. So let's take a close look at this indicator. This is an indicator that can perhaps help you in determining, you know, what's the major trend of the, of the overall market. And this is going to be based on the S&P market, and it's going to be based on a weekly chart. So we have the S&P uh, cash index up here. Uh, it's the S&P 500 cash index on a weekly chart. And you can see buy and sell signals here. Again, this isn't a trading system per se. It's more of an indicator. It's a longer term indicator that will help you determine uh, when uh, the market is bullish and when it is bearish. And it's done historically very well. We can take a look at how it's been doing recently as well. Okay, the code for this, of course, is available. Um, just to let you know, um, the program that we're going to be looking at is inspired by uh, Peter Connor's article, combining RSI with RSI in the January 2011 issue of Technical Analysis of Stocks and Commodities. So essentially this uh, indicator has been excellent at capturing the major moves in the S&P market as you can see here. Let's actually bring up the performance report so you can get a look at how this is performed and then we'll go into detail on how it works and you'll find that it's extremely simple. So here it is. We have uh, a 4.6 profit factor and what this is doing is just simply buying or selling short 100 shares. It's 100% of the market 100% of the time. Uh, it's just going to go along and then go short 100 shares. And again, it's not a trading system per se, but it can be helpful as an indicator. It's been 60% correct. There's only been um, 10 trades so far. This is going back to 1992 and all the way up through the end of the second quarter of 2012. You can see that we do have an open position. Uh, it's positive. It's $1,700. Okay, here's our average trade net profit. Consecutive wins five and two consecutive losing trades. And uh, we have an annual return of around 14%. This, um, I do believe, yeah, is taking out $20 per trade. So that's the only commissions that we're taking out, no slippage or anything. But we are taking out $20 per trade for commissions. So that gives you an idea on, on how well it has performed. The equity graph looks like this. And now let's take a look at see how does this work. Let me actually turn off. Well, we can keep these on, I think. That shouldn't be too bad. It's very simple. Essentially, what was pointed out in the article is the author realized that, let's see, let's take this for example, a strong bull trend. During a bull trend, the RSI never falls below 40. So, it does rise and fall. It overall never goes below the 40 mark. Likewise, during a big bear trend, the RSI tends to stay low, never arising above 60. So what we do is we take those extremes as major turning points. So when it's below 40, we're going to call that the market is bearish. And we're going to stay bearish until it rises above 60. So this isn't going to be catching tops and bottoms. What this is going to be catching is trying to capture the major trend of the market overall. And you can see just by eyeballing the trades that it's done pretty well. Of course, you can get whipsawed like any trading system like this here and there. It's going to happen. So again, as we pointed out, uh, this was inspired from an article in uh, Stocks and Commodities magazine. There's a couple modifications that I did. Let me bring up the source code and we can take a look at that. Okay, the first thing uh, we want to look at is this RSI calculation. It is a standard RSI calculation, except we're not taking the close. 
what we're going to do is take the high, low, and close, it's all right in here, of the bar that just closed. We're going to add those up and divide by 3. So what we're doing is we're taking the average value of the bar that just closed and we're going to feed that into our RSI function. Trend line length is 16. So once we got our RSI, I also thought that looked a little choppy. So what I did was pass the raw RSI value into a exponential moving average and that's a three period. So this is just a three period exponential moving average where we take the raw value of coming off of the RSI calculation and using a, a three to smooth it out just a little bit. And that creates our trigger. Then simply when the price crosses above our buy level, which is 60, we're going to go long. And when the trigger crosses below our sell level, which is 40, we're going to sell short. It's that simple. And that produces this trading uh, system here. You can see that it has done very well. It's that simple and it's available for download, but I also have created some indicators. Let me turn the indicators on. First the one I'll turn the RSI on. And here you can see this is what I just turned on and it's going to color code red when we're in a bearish and then it's going to go blue when we're in a bullish mode. And you can see it's a little bit more smoothed out than the traditional RSI which is up here in this first pane. The indicator underscore RSI is here. Okay, let me turn that off. Let me turn off the traditional one. I also created a paint bar indicator, turn that on, called RSI Weekly Trend. And what this will do is just simply take the RSI values and paint the price action accordingly. So it gives you a good visual representation of what's going on. So how is this indicator performing as of late or what is it telling us? Let's zoom in a little bit here. You can see we got a long signal um, on February 10th of 2012. And during this current pullback our paint bars have remained this light blue color so we're still in a bullish mode. You can see here uh, during 2011 when we had that violent move down that was enough to trigger us to go bearish but it turned out to be a false signal. You know how has this done? Well if you remember during the financial crisis this told us to get in on August 21st of 2009 which of course turned out to be an excellent signal. We're cap able to capture a lot of move here. During the financial crisis at the beginning, it got us out right here on January 25th of 2008. So just, just imagine that you could have avoided a lot of that pain by just simply following this. And perhaps that this is what it can be useful for monitoring your 401k or other such accounts. It's just an indicator, it's not a trading system, but it's a good indicator um, historically providing us an excellent green light, red light type of, um, of signal. So this is available for download. What you're going to get is the strategy, RSI Weekly Trend Strategy, which generates the buy and sell signals. Also what's available is the indicators, which is the paint bar and the RSI indicator. So you'll be able to get this paint bar up here and this RSI indicator. This comes also as a workspace so it's all ready to go and you know what I hope you find it useful. I find it useful to look at now and again just to help confirm if, um, which mode we're in. So until next time.